welcome back to my sewing room. My name is Robin and if you like these type of videos, please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any future videos. Today I'm going to show you how to make this very simple, quick and easy eyeglass case. It even holds my big sunglasses. Now this is made out of one pot holder and you'll just need some sewing thread to match. And I use my Cricut to embellish mine with some glitter iron on vinyl. And you can sew this in like two minutes. It's very quick and easy. And then however you want to embellish your eyeglass case to personalize for the person you're giving it to. So let's get started and I'll show you how to do it. Okay, to get started, you'll need a pot holder. I got two for a dollar at Dollar Tree and there are all kinds of colors. So you're gonna take your pot holder and this is gonna be the bottom of your eyeglass case. I'm gonna tuck this little loop inside, fold it over like this. And we're gonna sew starting a little bit below this curve. See the curve right here? Start a little bit below right there. And I got black thread. Whatever color your pot holder is, that's the color thread you want to use so it'll hide your stitches. So I'm going to start right about there to leave more room at the top for your glasses to go in. And I'm just gonna follow along the same stitches that are right here. Maybe you can see on this one. See the stitches? Just follow those same stitches and that way it'll be a nice clean finish. This is a really quick and easy gift to make. We're gonna start stitching right here, just a little bit down from that um, curve. So that allows more room. And the loop is tucked in here the loop is tucked in at the bottom. Then line this up so it's even. And we're gonna do a fixed stitch or you can do a back stitch there. And I'm just following the same stitches that are already there. Super easy. Now when you get here to the curve, you're gonna to wanna to make sure your needle is down to make that curve. I'm gonna do needle stop down. So every time I stop, my needle is down. Here, make sure this is even. See, the needle's down and the foot is up so I can pivot a little ever so slightly to get around this curve nicely and stain. And I'm just following that little red dot that's on my, in the middle of my foot so that it's easy to follow. And I just keep these stitches lined up with that little red dot in the center. I'll do a fixed stitch. There we go. Clip our threads. And there in a matter of, of a couple of minutes, we've got a finished eyeglass case. Okay, we finished sewing our eyeglass case. And I embellished mine with my Cricut with the glitter iron on vinyl to hold sunglasses. But if you don't have a Cricut, you can um, glue a button on it. And this one I used the outside because it said, let your dreams blossom. And I thought that was just so pretty. So that one kind of just decorated itself. I just added a button to that one. And you could also 
on this one I sewed a piece of fabric and then just slipped it on just slipped it right over so you could actually make different bands and just and add different bands for different holidays or different um, seasons of the year and this one holds my reading glasses and you could also this one it was a piece of fabric and I put fusible web on the back of it and you could just iron that onto your eyeglass case whatever design you want to pick for the person you're giving it to and you could also add a button like that or like this And these are not just for eyeglasses. You could pack your rotary cutter to go on a trip to protect it. And it even holds the bigger one like this. That way it protects it and protects you from getting cut. And there's one more thing you can do with this. Do you ever cook with an iron skillet? You can just fit that right over the handle like that and protect your hands and I even heard of you ever you know those long popsicles that kids eat outside and they're in a tube you can put those in here for kids little for little kids and it's too cold for their hands you could just put the popsicle right in here and they can hold it and it protects their hands from getting too cold and then you can just throw these in the wash so, so many things you can do with this. It's so simple, two minutes to sew, and it's a great last minute gift for somebody, especially if you have a Cricut. It's so pretty, I love this. So have fun sewing. Thank you for joining me today. Y'all have a so blessed day. Bye for now.